back in the caveman, cavewoman days, we had to remember the negative things where the poisonous berries, where are, um, you know, where is that animal that could possibly eat us? How do we stay away from basic survival things and elude basically death by remembering the things that were dangerous for us? So our brain still has this wiring. That is the reason why we can get a thousand compliments, maybe a million compliments, and one negative remark, one nasty remark, one invalidating remark. What do we remember? Do you remember the thousand or million or whatever number of compliments? Absolutely not. We concentrate the, the natural way is that we concentrate on the negativity. That's the most sticky thing for our brains. So there is a way to untrain this. So natural way of being, just normal human behavior, if left to its own devices without any training, will absolutely just collect negative experiences. So over time, as we get older, <laughs> more and more circumstances happen where we have an opportunity to collect these negative experiences and make them mean something. So all of the times that we felt hurt, all of the times that we felt betrayed or we felt shut down or invalidated or criticized or that we failed or that it was unsafe to trust people, we collect those and those experiences are a lot more sticky for us than all of the positive, beautiful, loving, connected, trusting, validating experiences. So let's talk basics about how to have our brain work for us. So we have to first hold the fact that if left to our, its own devices, our brain will just be a negativity processing machine. So in order to give your brain this positivity bias, you need to actively be looking to make a new case. The bottom line is we see what we're looking for. So if you are looking for instances where people build you up, you will see them. If you are looking for, so for my ladies out there, if you're looking for men being heroes and if you're scanning the world like that, wow, there's a man being a hero. Look, he just got flowers for his woman. Wow, there's a guy opening a door. Wow, look at that guy. He's really going out of his way to be a masculine, amazing energy right now. If you are looking for that, you will see it. So first is decide what case you wanna build for yourself. Do you wanna build a case that this world is a beautiful, loving place? that you can trust people, you will see it. Super practical tool, every morning, if possible, I would really, really suggest this, every morning, write for five minutes your miracles. You have so many miracles. Even if you're feeling rock bottom in this particular moment, you have so many freaking miracles. I'm guessing that you have shelter, even if you have debt. I'm guessing that even if you're single and you're unhappy about your single status, there is so much love in your life if you look for it. So every morning, write those miracles. If you work that muscle, your brain will start processing life through that filter of how am I being served right now? What miracles are in my life right now? So I really recommend that you, it doesn't have to be in the morning. I suggest morning just as a morning practice, morning miracles. Try it for two weeks. Try it for 10 days. Try it for two days. Do it once, see how it feels. But practice taking control of the negativity bias of your brain and skewing it back to the positive. I love you and keep on keeping on. You got this, babe.